at some point in your beekeeping career, you will have a colony that has succumbed to wax moths. We want to try to save some of the comb. The best way to do that is to spread the comb out in a location where it has access to light and air because wax moths like dark locations. But even with these frames that I have put out that ha still have light on each side and you can see down between the frames so they're not in an enclosed place, even these frames are dark enough to attract more wax moths. You can see here the moths running on the comb. They weren't there when I placed the comb. And a good thing to do is to squish them if you can. But I'm a little squeamish about that. Now, the comb looks sturdy, except for some uh, webbing. But when we dig into it, we see that there are actually wax moth larvae inside. They are eating the old um, pupal skins that are left from um, brood hatching out and pollen and will eventually destroy this whole frame of comb. This frame is probably too far gone to save in my opinion. 